podcast. I actually just came from a showing of a house. Man, let me tell you something. Okay. <laughs> you th- look, sometimes houses look good on like photos, and then you actually, damn, my skin looks good. Anyways, <clears throat> and you actually come see it, and it's just a, uh, it's just not it. This house is in Lay Hood. Um, I, I, no. It was just like the house just, I don't know, like presentation wise, like it had, there was like a lot of like gun shells, like as in like, you know, you know, like when, you know, Negroes have like holidays and stuff like that. (laughs) They'll like like shoot guns in the air. It was like hella bullets and hella like casings on lay floor, on lay patio, in lay kitchen in lay room in lay house okay <laughs> and i was just like oh no that just makes me feel uneasy because like i don't know why you have shellings outside um and i just don't uh, really too much to find out you know what i'm saying <laughs> i don't even look at, i really don't want to find out um so there's that and then like there were like missing windows and like all the like windows were actually like missing missing um, and then it wasn't as bright as I thought it would be. It's a, actually like a nice layout for a house. But for what they're asking, I feel like the house could have, have been at least a little more presentable. But like bullets, bullet fragments, and casing on the floor. I think the fuck not. <laughs> Good morning. It is uh i don't know what day it is i'm not gonna lie to you excuse my room it's a mess i am slowly packing things away uh to move and um i'm also a little bit under the weather so there's that at least my bed is spread right okay (laughs) um so right now i am heading to go um look at a few houses i'm super excited about this journey uh, uh, there's like five houses I'm looking at today, but there's one in particular. Well, there's actually a few that I like, but there's one in particular where I can see the vision of what I'm looking for. What I'm looking for can be executed a lot faster than all the other ones. Um, and also it's four bathrooms, four bedrooms, two bathrooms. And with that, I can convert one of the rooms into a master ensuite slash beauty closet so <clears throat> i'm excited about this um i'm just so excited about this journey um i'm just ready for it. this is my first investment property not my forever home but i'm really excited about this because i'm just ready to get this over with and move and be in my own space yeah no i love to be in my own space anyways let me go ahead and head out i need to make some tea because my throat is just like not not with it today <laughs> it's not with it at all today um i need to start looking at the lens and not the screen okay so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and head out and i'm gonna take you guys with me I'm probably gonna stop at dunkin donuts to get some coffee or some tea because i thought it was a little mucusy and yeah it's not cute all right hey y'all day, so that you can so find I'm at my first stop i'm waiting for my real estate agent to you know come on the roof <laughs> and show me what i do um but you this like house is actually really nice place. I think the price point of this house is, this is the first house, um, let me look at the the listing. I think it was at 175 which is my higher end. Again, I this is an investment property for me and not a forever home, so I'm looking for, my idea was to find something under 150 that may need some renovations and like, I may have to like do some fixing to it, but not a lot. Um, in a gentrifying ish neighborhood or a neighborhood that looks like it, it can be developed more and the houses are raising in value i love this house on the outside the curb pill is nice i am however just waiting for my agent to show up and once she shows up then i'm going to go inside but this house is ranging at yep 175 i'm trying to do my notes right now while i'm sitting here waiting for her um how do you? Can I wonder if I could do this in my notes, like add pictures? Um, oh, you can. Okay. All right. So, um, this house is at 175, so it's at the higher end of my budget. Um, let me. How do I? Okay, whatever. 
make that smaller. Can I make it smaller? Or no, it's like one size. <laughs> one size fits all. Uh, um, um, let's edit that and make it smaller. I'm currently listening to The Read. It is a hilarious podcast if you have not listened to it. I found out about The Read from... Um, I, was, I don't know, I, I stumbled upon, or maybe my mom sent it to me, I don't know. Um, I stumbled upon, or she sent it to me, this, um, this, this, like, um, the woman who's on, I forget her name, but she was doing a, um, she was, like, at a graduation, and kind of, she was the guest speaker at the graduation, and, um, She's she's mentioned the podcast and the, the 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 speech was so funny to me like I was like okay let me just like check this podcast out and then I checked it out and I'm I'm, I'm absolutely in love like it's hilarious um, it's similar to me to like um, I used to listen to um, what is it called I used to listening I used to listen to um, friends sex with strangers it gives me that vibe but it's a lot more funnier a lot more relatable but it's hilarious. I am currently doing my pros. So, so what I'm doing right now is, right, I have my phone and I have my pros and my cons list. I have all the pictures of each property that I'm looking at today. People looking at the house. This is the only thing about this market right now is that it's 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 going to be really hard to find a house. But I know that whatever house God has for me is going to be for me. So I'm not really worried about, like, the aspect of all this, like, stressing over things. I mean, I'm just hoping that whatever house I choose... Or let's just say that God chooses because, like, I'm taking him along the journey with me because I want to make sure that I'm making the best decision that's going to be beneficial.
Alrighty y'all, I am seeing all three houses and um, I, I have one that I, I absolutely love. Like I feel like it'd be perfect for me. The backyard is small, not a lot of yard work, perfect. It has a garage, um, nice lighting in the house. The kitchen is already renovated, comes with appliances. Um, the house is, I think it has washer and dryer connections if I'm not mistaken, I think. Let me try it again. <clears throat> I think it has washer and dryer connections. I see that I see where I can knock it on the wall and add an island. It has a patio, um, a small yard. Everything is already upgraded. I don't remember if there was a wash and dryer hookup in the house, but for the price point, I could always add that in later. I'm not really too pressed about it. Um, and then like it had like an extra flex space upstairs. It was a three bedroom, two bath. I think that I would probably turn, I, I would have to like upgrade the bathroom and make the master bathroom a little bit bigger. I like that there's two rooms upstairs and one room downstairs. So if I did decide to get a roommate or do Airbnb or whatever I decide to do with my extra space, and they don't have to be like in my space, they can have their own entrance and exit through the garage, which is perfect. Ah, uh, it's close to a lot of grocery stores. Like it's a good, good experience to everything. This other house is nice as well. However, it need it was the lower end was the one I thought was gonna be my favorite, but it's not. It's the lower end, which is a good price point. I can see where I can upgrade it. I can see how I, I would have to do work to this house, which is not bad. Um, I would definitely have to do the same thing with the master bedroom, but it's just a lot less work for the other house for the ten thousand dollars more. Um, and then my real estate agent said that um, they don't think there's any offers on the house right now. So since there's no offers yet, I could go up more in price. And then, you know, just a lot of things I can do. So I'm just super excited about this journey. I'm ready to like get this party started. I'm ready to put things in motion. Somebody called me, I don't know who. So let me call this number back. Talk to you later. Thank you. So yeah, I found the house I love, 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 love. Oops. I love, 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 love. I'm super excited about this, y'all. Please, I'll see you later. Bye.